What's up, everybody? Today, we're playing some more Across the Obelisk with... Uh, yeah. Yeah, and I got Scott with me today, and it's not James. Uh-huh. James has fallen off of the face of the earth, so uh, Scott is here to be Walmart James once again. Indeed. <laughs> uh, and we're here showing uh, off all of the new characters in uh, the new build of ATO, which is currently still in beta. There's some jank involved. Uh, but it's got all the new characters, it's got a whole new zone, and all of that cool new stuff, and I figured we were going to show it off. So, uh, we got Bree, who is a thorny tank, so you know I'm all about it. Uh, Gustav is the rock and roll frog bard. Uh, Zek is the frost dark rat from the sewers. And Sylvie is generic elf. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> like, it's just Legolas with like three Z's. Um, they also, uh, I can point out here, uh, have a whole new perk system where instead of just you level up and you get everything, now there's they give you all kinds of choices and you only have 50 perks and there's actually decisions to be made. There's a general tab. It's got your your health and potentially starting money and speed and energy and stuff like that physical is your your sharp or your slashing your piercing your blunt your block bleed sharp thorns all that fun stuff elemental is what you'd expect fire ice lightning uh shield i don't know why that's an elemental but it is <laughs> uh and then mystical which is your your holy your dark your mind and healing so, uh, between all of these things, you only get 50 points. Certain perks at the end, uh, the ones with the gray circle cost one point. The ones with the gold circle cost three points. And the ones with the boxes cost three points, but you have multiple options. And, uh, it means that you can pretty much do whatever build you want. The customization is off the charts. It's probably the best change this game's ever had. <laughs> Uh, and on that note, let's start. <laughs> yeah. So, see, these characters don't have amazing uh, synergies with one another, but they're all the new characters, so we got to show them off. Yep. Uh, and I saved up all of my treasures to make this run go as smoothly as possible. Uh, there's also some new pets. Uh, we don't have all of them unlocked. Uh, oh, they, they, they gave us the bunny. Oh, sweet. <laughs> uh, yeah, because the, the intended method of getting the bunny is supposed to be, like, once you first unlock the pet shop, you just get the bunny as, like, the, the basic default pet, so I guess that's a yeah. thing now. Okay. And then there's Champy, Chompy, and Chumpy. There's uh, three beavers that do slightly different things. Uh, and then there's Daily, whom I don't have unlocked yet. Uh, I actually had the opportunity to recently because it requires finding an uncommon event in the new zone. But then once you're in that event, it requires you to have gold. And when I was there, I didn't have any gold. So, there you are. You're just a poor boy. Nobody loves you. I'm just a poor boy with a poor family spared my life from this monstrosity. <laughs> Etc. 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 So I'm going to use one of the new pets with Bree, Champy. Every two turns casts Palisade. Palisade grants all heroes block and thorns. Y you'd you'd think for the thorny character that'd be pretty good. And it is, <laughs> as it turns out. <laughs> uh, so the bunny casts Hurry Up. The Hurry Up is just every two turns gain one speed on self, which is, eh. Uh, Sylvie doesn't get to buy a pet. Oh, I mean, she can, but she wouldn't. Because <laughs> she doesn't have to. Sylvie starts with a pet called Harley. And Harley, every turn casts Bird of Prey, which hits the back monster and then does a little bit of bleed and a little bit of sight. She is the other character that has some sight synergies, slightly, kind of, a little. <laughs> sort of. Kind of, sort of. Well, there's not really anything going on except for the the lost sheep and riverbank. 
You know what that means. <laughs> the <Yeah>. hatch. <laughs> Uh, oh, there's some oh, very funky cheese. Corrupt cheese. Uh, man, you get the cheese and the garnet earrings, and you're starting very vitalicized. It's like italicized. You're, you're like slightly slanted, but healthier. <laughs> you know what? I will have a very vital Gustav. <laughs> Absolutely vital. Um. Uh, yeah, I don't think I need anything else here, so I think I'm good. Well, I'll take the quiver for Sylvie, because you know. I mean, that makes sense. Sharp. Are you saying that the archer wants a quiver? Makes no sense. Weird. Uh. So here's all of our crew. I I love how thick Bree is. Uh oh, and uh up until very recently the beaver pet looked like a sheep, but now the beaver pet looks like a beaver. And the owl looks like an owl. The owl does look like an owl. The hypno crab. <laughs> <laughs> look, I saw nothing wrong with that. Yeah, I'll buff everybody. Uh Actually, just because I didn't really show it off. Standard bears, breeze, like fancy card, heals for the amount in your hand, and then grants one inspire, two thorns, and one power to everybody. That's so helpful. Uh, and I don't think this fight's going to last long enough for Entrench to matter, so I'm just going to make us as spiky as possible. Uh, so Power Slave is another card that's just X equals your hand and then it applies some crazy and gains him sharp and powerful. And other than that, he's just kind of a bard doing bardy things. Yep. He will croak you the song of his people. Except it doesn't sound like a croak at all. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, you got your unique card. Yep. Falcon so, shot. That's a deals X amount of damage and X amount of sight, which equals your hand size, then applies bleed, and then the bottom half is cut off if there's anything past the bleed part. Uh, you gain sharp. Ah, okay. So there you go. Oh, yeah, there it is. Gain three sharp. But these are all dead now, so... <laughs> And just in case you're curious, all of the corn is dead now. Uh, ooh, that is a corrupt dark pact. Uh, yeah, it's sort of it's sort of a Zexus thing. Why not? All right, uh, the crops are on fire. We have a unique option with Sylvie. Fifty-fifty chance to snipe the imp. Yeah, I would have thought it'd be higher, but I guess I have a lot of, like, buff cards. Eh, hey, we'll try it. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> <laughs> you you, you could have been uh, a little better with your aim. But look, it's only Act 1. We're, we've only just started. You gotta, you gotta hone it in. <laughs> because you didn't snipe the imp, we are now all on fire. <laughs> Excellent. You did this. Uh, let's see. I could do that, or I could do that. The the poison effect is green now on the the health bar. Uh, it was green before, but the it, the weird thing about it is that the bleed makes the bar green because we have the perk that makes, like, we, we can apply bleed to enemies that are immune to it or have buffer, oh. but it will deal damage at the end of the turn instead so, of at the start of their that's turn. That's why it's green. I didn't, for some reason, yeah. I didn't realize that you had taken that perk. Yep. Uh, so let's, let's go look at Scott's perks real quick here. Oh, yeah, and there it is. 
So Scott took the perk where he applies plus two charges, but bleed on enemy is uh, cannot be prevented by buffer or immunity, but it deals damage at the end of the turn. Well, there you go. Yep. Uh, oh no. So there's a burning house. We can... 60% <laughs> chance uh, to hold the beams of the house, but it's the new character option. That's, we gotta do it. That's better than Sylvie had. Ha -ha! There you go. Look at that. Look, Bree Strong. What did we get for our efforts? Uh, a, a fancy silver ring that is kind of crap, and then a bunch of other crap. Yeah, it's not impressive. Look, I held up a house. I'm getting something out of it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Into the hatch we go. Uh... <laughs> Gustav, do you want ammunition? <laughs> if that was for Sylvie, I would probably take it, but uh, not for Gustav. Fair enough. But why not? They sigh. Uh, okay. Just spikes. And spikes. And there you go. I, I, I did a good. Kill them all now. Because that's what Gustav does. I, he can. He can. He's not built for that right now, though. I will make everyone vital instead. Yeah, vitality doesn't give you the hit points for the extra hit points that it gives you now, so it looks like we're all hurt, but we just we've gained more potential hit points. <laughs> vitality used to uh, just heal you for as much extra HP it did. Now it doesn't. Okay, well, let's just... Zek actually got a turn. Yeah, I know. This is weird. Uh, yeah. Just jump around a little bit of that. And do, do some of that. And then I'm going to do it again. Just do some of that. And then, um... I don't think anyone's going to need energy, so I'm just going to not. How dare you heal? There we go. <laughs> Get thorn blasted? Bree with the kill. Look at you. It's saying that you can't attack. Look at all this. Look at all this death that you're dealing out right now. You know what? I'll give myself the sharp. You get him. Shivin. And then... Uh... <laughs> Zek has the lowest HP. He might actually need this. <laughs> because of vitality, we don't know what that means anymore. <laughs> yeah. Okay. And a whole lot of nothing and a whole lot of nothing. All right, into the hatch we go. Uh, will we break our legs? Oh, gosh. <laughs> that was... Zek is fine. <laughs> and he was the one who had the lowest chance of success at 50%. Yeah. Every everyone else had better <laughs> than a coin flip and failed. That's about par for the course. <laughs> yeah. So that, that sounds right. The XCOM odds. Oh, yeah. Well, I guess we just, uh, we don't have a rope to tie any of these guys up, so we just gotta beat them up. Ha! Ah, you thought you were faster than me, frog. Look, I will be once you get rid of that banner. <laughs> and replace it with something that gives me even more speed.
Alright. Finish them all, Sylvie. I don't know that that's going to happen. Just, you know, just, just finish them all. Just make them all dead. Unalive them. I got two out of three. How's that? Hmm. I, I I think I have a lot of multi-target things going on with Zach, so... <laughs> Look, I took care of two out of three. This is a little, little problematic, but it's fine. Take that. And take that. Oh, well, he did effectively nothing, so it's fine, I guess. <laughs> uh, no, uh, no Gustav kill. Uh, oh, you, you know what I'll say, though? If there's a, a pet trainer that comes up, I very much am interested in getting the pet trainer for Bree, because everyone else's pets are baseline useful, and mine isn't unless it gets upgraded. <laughs> Because uh, the 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 beavers all do cool things, but they do cool things every two turns, which is remarkably less good. It's like the thing that it does do is very good if it ever happens. <laughs> Miss with this nonsense, giving ammunitions and ice shots to Gustav. Look, you were you were looking at it, and you're seeing everything that Sylvia was doing, and you're like, that seemed pretty neat. Also, I'll take money. They're immune to poison. That affects like what one of Sylvie's cards? Yeah, maybe. <laughs> the the upper roots, I guess. Yeah. Uh, thorns, and thorns, and thorns, and thorns. Ooh. Gustav over here singing the song of his people. There's something off about you being like healing a serenade, and then I I see your health bar go down. I know your hit points <laughs> haven't gone down. Yep. But I just physically watch your red bar get smaller, and I'm just like, there's something about that I don't like. It's fine. Also, they're dead. <laughs> so they are. That one pig just barely survived the first volley. If I was going for a, a crack build, that bludgeon would be very tasty, but not today. Okay. Oh, boy. It's... Uh, we. I mean, look, this is the very Bree option. <laughs> we just got to break it. Smash and grab. Aww. And that would have been a great draw for the other one. Uh-huh. I know if you critically succeed that event, you, you break a hole into the secret room. <laughs> but uh, not today. Uh, also, that's like the the altar. I don't. I've never fought the altar like this. No. No. This is this is a new experience for me, actually. <laughs> uh. Eh. How are you making the altar crazy? How is the altar going to attack? It's sentient. Well, I I know all rocks are sentiment. No, no, <laughs> not not sediment. <laughs> <laughs> Nerd. Ah. <laughs> uh, 
y you'd think I'd be a father with all the dad humor that I, I put out into the world. No, it's just me. <laughs> uh, I was gonna say, well, which one are you launching out? He's dead. <laughs> well, so so far, this is just... Zek is here. <laughs> <laughs> it, it, it's a weird day when Sylvie hasn't killed everything. I might. One. I mean, that's an adrenaline. Come on, now. Yeah. <laughs> I, I see you pausing there like you're choosing something. Uh, he is a specialist in these sorts of rituals. They don't need to look at Zach twice before uh, to know he's telling the truth. Since he's already here, so he's no problem helping you with the ritual. Also, Zek leveled up. <laughs> Take that. He's leaving you guys in the dust. <laughs> uh, so I'll look at his talents real quick here. So at the start of his turn, he suffers one dark and applies one dark to all enemies. He wants dark on him uh, for reasons that we'll get into next level. Uh, but for now... I think we'll go with Soul Harvest. Draw one card, deal eight uh, ice damage, apply three chill and two dark to the highest HP monster, suffer one dark for the next three spells casts. All right. And then I believe that skips a fight. Yeah. Normally you have to fight the cultists to try to stop them from completing the ritual. All right, this is something I don't think you're just going to be able to take out in one turn. Prove me wrong. I mean, I'll certainly try. <laughs> uh, let's see. If I do... I think the upgrade is worth it. I didn't get a... Yeah ton of damage here, but... Well, That's something. I'm reasonably confident that Zex won't be able to. Uh, that said, the uh, Winter Orb's not bad. Dark Pack's not bad. And you know what? There. Take that. Take one of those. <laughs> oh, oh, I like that. Do that some more. He did do so, it some more. We almost killed them in the first round, but mostly through a combination of direct damage, uh -huh. thorns, and bleed poison. <laughs> Bloi Bloison. Bloison, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if you double accuracy yourself and then shiv, oh, that's... No. Look, I was trying to give it, you it, some glory. <laughs> it wouldn't have been enough. You don't know. <gasps> oh my god, Palisade went off. <laughs> Uh, this is a little sad. Well, if you shield charge, yeah. it would slow him down enough that he won't get a turn. And then that just means that you could finish the fight, so there you go. Uh -huh. <laughs> Your bird almost uh, did it. Yeah. Oh, this is the <laughs> saddest possible hand. You were supposed to be the chosen one. Profound sadness. Well, I killed the two front imps. Alright, Zek. I guess I'll finish it. <laughs> Such a golden opportunity wasted. <laughs>
Oh, and now my other character gets to level up. And presumably yours does too. Yes. Uh, so, Bree, at the start of each combat, she gains five thorns. That's sort of her thing. And then we're going to grab Unforgiving Nature. Crack and Thorn Charge is plus one. And then damage with hit. Uh, she'll deal additional blunt damage and crack. Uh, for the way I'm building her, it's mostly just the Thorn Charge plus one, if I'm being honest. Maximum Thorns. Is there some... Uh, uh, there it is. I was like, is there some kind of heavy debate going on your side? Well, there's no debate here. All of this sucks. Yeah, reinforced armor is okay for starting armor. Right, let's get out of the basement. And up into the northern plains. Um, we don't have a air quotes healer, so we can't get card removal for free. So getting rid of our broken bones isn't an awful option here. Yeah, I like that. All right. It's a bunch of big... Oh, my broken bones! <laughs> Uh, yo. Nah, even if I did that, I would be able to afford it, so eh. Alright. Oh, melodic rhythm. Yeah. Re rejuvenation charges plus one. The next four song spells. All heroes recover 6% HP and gain two regen. Interesting. It's pretty sweet. Whenever I play Gustav, it's angry Gustav, so. I, I never have seen that card before because I've never taken it. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say that, that matters for precisely Zex. <laughs> yeah, Zex is slow. He is the fastest mage, I'll have you know. <laughs> It's like saying he's the fastest toddler in the Olympic sprints, but still. <laughs> well, uh, if I had drawn an attack... I mean, you can just... Oh, uh, that's fine. Yeah. I'll just do that. Quick shot a couple of pigs. I said I would have ended with the camouflage, because those quick shots were already killing. I mean, I'm not getting another turn, am I? <laughs> I mean, you don't know! <laughs> you could! I, I would have been concerned if Zek hadn't, like, been able to kill them. Look, may maybe Zek is just all about pacifism. Uh, wish I could also get rid of Sylvie's low self-esteem, but <laughs> oh yeah, she had she had an extra. Enough. Yeah, she still has an injury. It's okay. We could get low self-esteem for everybody here. <laughs> Only if we're really bad, which we were. <laughs> 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 now, instead of it being exclusive to her, she just has twice as much as everyone else. I feel like you set us up. <laughs> if you say the thing, the thing happens every time. Uh-huh. And they're all going fast because we got ambushed. Before I can set up my thorns... Thorns, 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 and uh, also thorns. Oh, you had low self-esteem about it. Oh, that 
melodic rhythm, you can do a lot of making everything better, though. Uh-huh. Look at that. Everyone's <laughs> fine. Through the power of song. Oh. That was unfortunate. Oh, Elven Agility is your new card here. Sharp Charge is plus one. That's just so bad, though. Get, uh, getting both low self-esteems for my first turn means this is a setup turn. Yeah, that's fine. Zex is going to finish it all right here, right now. Here we go. Zek. Um... I suppose that is a double winter orb. That's not yeah. bad. And then, and then some. I'm going to do it with the Zex, plural, because you keep on correcting me and I refuse to acknowledge it. Zek. <laughs> Zex. It's not an X, it's a K. <laughs> <laughs> Rat. <laughs> Ox. Ein. <laughs> Aust. <laughs> well, a rare chance for the Gustav kill. Oh, yeah. He can actually okay. do... Uh, oh, he does still have one yeah. melodic rhythm, so I can do... Well, I was going to say, you could vitalizing... That. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's even and better. That, yeah, that just yeah, these won't actually yeah. heal. So, boop, ta-da! Nope, nope. All right, uh, a pig and three wolves, or a pig and three wolves? Yes. Yes. <laughs> of course. <laughs> Now hold on. Hold on. Uh, uh, hold on. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> Take that. Oh, winds of amnesia. Ugh. Yeah, we but, don't uh, need an upgrade altar. We the, yeah, those are yeah. crapper. Ones. Yeah, need none of that stuff. Oh, I'm sad about it. I'm sad about the rewards that they offered us. <laughs> Me too. Well, so is Betty. She's having a tantrum over it. <laughs> weird. You put the stanza two card back on top of your deck? That's weird. I know, right? All right, finish them all. Right here, right now. Hmm. I mean, that wasn't half bad. But you didn't complete the assignment. Failure! <laughs> Aww. All right, I'm out. Bye. <laughs> Okay, bye. A player is disconnected. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, we're not being offered anything good. Ah, but this is this is the beauty. Bree, <laughs> you bastard, I'll clean this forest of you and your werewolf gang. Uh Bree takes no crap from nobody. It's too bad we didn't go to the campsite where she just like Caves in one of the werewolf skulls with her club. Bree is the best character, and I will hear nothing otherwise. Uh, you know what? I'll, I'll give him a little clomp.
You you have a very sharp song to sing. <laughs> All right, finish him. Honestly, this uh, this is probably your best is, hand to try to do it. Actually, yeah, I do have the rapid fire, so that's pretty good. Double uproot camouflage rapid fire, I th think, gives you your best opportunity. Yeah, because I don't think yeah. the multi shot is worth it. That's pretty okay. That's not it's bad. It's not a kill, but it's pretty good. Uh, okay. Uh, I'm gonna do this to draw a card. Bree's gonna be able to finish this, don't you worry. That's <laughs> literally all I could do. Play every card in my hand. Okay. How dare you presume that she's going to get another turn. You never know. Ow. The, the rat was going to go before her. <laughs> <laughs> this is cheating. Not anymore. This is cheating. <laughs> <laughs> there. And then Harley's just like we're done. I count that as Sylvie not taking the turn. That's how. Sure, whatever. That, that's how I have to rationalize it. <laughs> I gave that that battle shout. I gave that power to Harley specifically. <laughs> uh, oh, that brigand armor though. It's like I have a breastplate. It's like less protection, but more speed. I do like the speed, but. Zex could also use it. He doesn't. Yeah, have I was gonna say Zex has so. no armor, so that's very good for him, and it helps him be less horribly slow. <laughs> Fastest mage. <laughs> uh, you know what? She doesn't need the slashing damage, but I'll take the bleeding on hit. You sort of have a thing going here. 38%. Let's go! Oh, why? <laughs> why you do this to me? You could do it. Because I do it to him. It. <laughs> Three steps forward, starting at the triad, and then it's just like, stop it. <laughs> I just take care of the ads just immediately. Just get out of here. Bree is an absolute boss. Um, uh, I th think it's either Stockade Battle Shout or Entrenched Spike Shield. I think I like Stockade Battle Shout. You would. I do. You nerd. <laughs> You're just like, that's more powerful for my elf. <laughs> well, it's more powerful for everybody. It's also reinforced, which will help us when dealing with the thorns. You're like powerful for everybody, but at least two of the characters give absolutely no cares about the powerful. And one tries, but isn't that good at it. And then there's Sylvie. <laughs> <laughs> Look, it's not my fault that Sylvie is the highest DPS here. Yeah, it is. You could have made her worse. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I, I suppose I could have... Actively <laughs> tried to build her poorly. So there you go. It was. I'm fault. sorry. I didn't try to 
tail. <laughs> Apology accepted. <laughs> <laughs> Absolute lunatic. Uh huh. <laughs> Go on. Uh, I might get another turn. Yeah, like I could get that energy to Sylvie, but nah. <laughs> she doesn't need it. Uh, not with hands like this. Yeah, I was uh, gonna say, low could... self esteem has gotta go. Yeah, why do you have more low self esteem than anybody else, Sylvie? Have you looked at the damage numbers? <laughs> <laughs> You're like triple the next highest person. There, 51 bleed on the guy that's immune to bleed. It's because it's like a poisonous bleed and he's not immune to poison? <laughs> yes. This is like the saddest shiv. That's that's. <laughs> <laughs> that that was uh, somewhat disappointing. Uh, soul harvest. Uh, eh. Just hit you with a little bit of everything. Ah, there we are, a winter orb. And a water jet. Yeah, and you can cast that winter orb twice. And the water jet. <laughs> That'll actually kill him. And the water jet. And the water jet. <laughs> <laughs> the water jet was all I needed. <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> Uh... Oh, did you want to be battery, Zek? Because <laughs> there's battery cards. Just all of the battery cards. So I noticed. Uh, the scroll is just fine. Yeah, the scroll is good. Even if you're not playing actual battery. Uh, show me corrupt... Ooh, mm, corrupt I Yggdrasil root. I wanted the corrupt shield of thorns. Because the Corrupt Shield of Thorns is... You take that to the end game, baby. Uh, as far as this is concerned... Don't think he needs anything. Um, I almost I... want to take the Corrupt Leather Boots because they're as good as the Boots of Speed. I do think that I'm going to take that, that route because the Thorns every turn is nuts. Yeah, so that's normally cool. combat start. Yep. I wish that his songs counted as healing spells, but they don't, so the branch is useless. Well, uh, the healing done counts if you're doing actual healing songs, but you have yeah, more like it's, it's yeah. just a, a flat one healing done. It's well, I'm not saying it's good, I'm just saying it does something. <laughs> it's... Uh... Alright, so now, do we go to the new zone next, or do we go... I say that let's leave the... Let's, let's save the blue portal for, uh... For third, to, to build suspense. Okay. So, uh... Uh, typically red is just better for just beating up multiple bosses and doing things like that. And, like, unless you need something specifically from the green portal, which I don't think we do. Yeah, I don't think so. Right. We'll go red portal, and then we'll go blue portal next. Uh, oh, oh, there's a Pokemon's oh. trainer. All right, I want to go there. I need that. I need it real bad. <gasps> and an amulet of thorns. <laughs> oh, Look man. Look at that. Just, uh, just take one of them. Stimulant pills is tempting. Uh, 
Let's see. Get get everybody's low self-esteem. Everyone start feeling better about yourselves. Get those pep talks going. Onward right. towards the pet trainer. It's the only thing I need. Oh, a rare equipment shop could be fine. Yeah, it could be something good in there. Maybe. Hopefully. Oh man, Bree's only the third fastest now. Yeah, things have changed. Sylvie's the slowest now. What did you do to Zack? Zack is fastest mage. I tried to <laughs> tell you. Lapis necklace, huh? Yeah. I could <laughs> really trying to compensate. I could have gave him the necklace or the amulet of speed, but I purposely didn't buy it because I was trying to find a frostfire ring and it didn't work. So if anything, he could have been a little faster. Uh, what is this hand? Game? Uh, it's a cold snap, a mana gem, a dark ritual, a life tap, and a dark pact. Thank you. You're welcome. Thought maybe you, you were having trouble reading it with your old man eyes. Oh, with my old man eyes. <laughs> <laughs> no one wants old man eyes. <laughs> uh... Uh, excellent. Let's do all of these things. Let's just, let's just get thorned. Uh, so I'm going to end my first turn with 151 thorns. Meh. Sight. How dare you? <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> the beginning of Act 2? I don't even have, like, all of my cool thorns talents yet. Yeah, maybe if you did, it would have been okay. How dare <laughs> you? <laughs> I know where you live. I'll come over there right now. <laughs> like, no one will ever going to be able to appreciate my thorns, because nothing will live long enough. <laughs> Look, oh, look at that! 100 entirely. damage, baby! 89 damage, come on! Oh, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> uh, hey, look, a scroll of intellect. <laughs> um, Ooh, a harp. Uh, Red Sail Cloak's not yeah. bad either. I do have the stimulant pills though, which are pretty good. Oh, I was looking at Sylvie and be like, does Sylvie want the red steel cloak? Oh, she's already wearing it. Never mind. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but as tempting as the harp is, I think I might stick the pills. I'm not even going to buy it on Zek because it's not that much of an upgrade and I feel like I'm going to get something better later. The Dying Merchant. 38% chance. Uh, what happens on a failure here? Uh, I think you fall and get a broken bone. <laughs> We could do it. Almost. Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, I guess on a regular failure, you're just like, nope, never mind. Can't do it. I suppose that's fine. Sorry, merchant. Oh, this is going to make Chumpy, like, actually amazing. Yeah, I, I like that training Harley isn't even an option here, which makes sense. Because. Oh, yeah, that is every turn. Yes. Yeah. Nice. Like, that's insanely good. Yeah, that is that is interesting. Sylvie is just like, I don't get to participate because that's my level 5 talent. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, so do we want to go down uh, and fight the boss? Or, okay, yeah, Minotaur boss yeah, is good. I, was say, I, I went up to fight a boss. <laughs> <clears throat> that's the nice thing about the, the lava area is just it's chock-filled with bosses. 
It's very boss centric. <laughs> we get it. She's sharp. <laughs> Um, eh, eh, and then I guess I just something like that. Whew, that's ten thorns for everybody. Yeah. Just, just thorn right up here. If he were whirlwinding, which he's not, but if he was, he would be having a very bad day. I didn't know if he was going to or not first turn, which is why I was just like, well, I guess I'm going to stockade here and get the thorns up. Mm, probably. Much energy. I think yeah. I want the poison yeah, I was gonna spray. Say, out of those, I think poison spray is probably the best. You got poison, poison, and bleed poison. <laughs> All right. More arrows. Oh. Can you can you speed Bree up so that Bree could do a thing? Uh. Yeah. <laughs> 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 With all of the confidence in the world. I. I'm actually curious to see if Melodic Rhythms Heal will trigger the Winged Wand. Guess we're about to find out. It... Did, wait... Uh, did they unnerf Vital... When you I'm confused, because it's like sometimes you're getting the instant health... We weren't a minute ago, were we? No. I don't know. I'm. I don't know what's going on, well, but I can't. I, I thought we got healed her. through the melodic rhythm. No. Weird. I I don't know what's going on. Maybe maybe they very quickly unnerved vitality. But I I feel yeah. like for the first few fights we were getting that weird health gap where. Yeah, well, like I, I said, I'm 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 convinced it has something to do with the melodic rhythm. No, because before what was happening was it was giving us the health gap and then the melodic rhythm would trigger. But this time it's just everyone's health immediately jumped up. Ah, uh, porcupine, go! Oh, it wasn't enough. <laughs> I I feel offended. Oh, torment of thorns. There you go. Uh, well, hold on a second. Let's uh, just in case anyone was missing any health. <laughs> there we go. An, an upgraded. Oh, okay. It's a bouncing shield. Um. I don't need an. Oh, I'll take another cold snap any day of the week. I don't think I'm going to need the bouncing shield. Scott thinking long and hard here. 
Yeah, I'm debating the Ballad of Evasion, but I don't think I want a second one. I thought you were reminiscing about the good old days of Ambidextrous when it worked for ancient attacks. Uh, I don't <laughs> want to talk about it. <laughs> that was such a hard nerf for Sylvie. The goggles! I could take the Minotaur Horn, but... Like, the whole healing... <laughs> vitality... It's working weird at the moment. I don't get it. Uh, yeah, let's see if I can make something happen with that. Oh, you didn't want the, the goggles on Sylvie? She was the only one that could reasonably use them. Nah. Uh, get the coin flip. Oh, All right. successful coin flip was successful. We had to win a coin flip someday. Yeah, it was bound to happen. Oh, uh, wow, these rewards are terrible. Yep. If we had failed that, then that reward would have been great. <laughs> Just we all get something bad in our deck and then immediately like, let's get rid of that. See, if I just play this. See? It's now it's filling up people's health. Uh, maybe you broke the game. I like I'm not going crazy, right? Like earlier it was well, increasing max health, but not current health. These are two separate issues. You're definitely going crazy, but I think something <laughs> is going on here as well. Fair enough. <laughs> Or maybe, maybe they hadn't actually nerfed Vitality. Maybe that was actually a bug, and they hotfixed it right before we started While we this. were playing. <laughs> yeah, because it totally was doing it in Act 1. Yep, <laughs> that was definitely a thing that was happening. Don't worry, just just doing Zek things, making everybody cold. <laughs> oh, that palisade every turn so good. Uh instead of giving everybody thorns, I think uh, I guess I can give everybody thorns. But I could double mine up to one twenty, so if they hit me they just explode. But yeah. you don't know if they'll hit you. Oh, they're totally gonna hit me. <laughs> no one ever hits the front hero. <laughs> that's impossible. It's scientifically proven. Oh, wow, that's a corrupt barrage. I... Um, the sad thing is, I actually probably shouldn't play it because if I volley, they're pretty much dead. But that's a Beautiful. I just want to look at it for a second. <laughs> Can I just bask in its glory? In all of its temporary glory? <laughs> all of its temporary glory that you're immediately going to shun. And so don't you want to, <sighs> don't you want to uproot first just for some vulnerable? Yeah, just because you can? Uh, I oh, yeah, you're, stealth, you're in stealth. Yeah, that's true. Like That volley was too good not to do. <laughs> All right. Aha, your bleed happens last, which means that my thorns will kill them all. <laughs> yep. See how generous I am allowing you to feel like you're helpful? <laughs> Ow! <laughs> I'm going to turn this car right around, young man. <laughs> oh, I could take hell drops. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm helping. Hold on, that that's a skill, right? That's a skill. I have an advanced handbook that would make it free. <laughs> nah. Yeah, you're not specced into it or anything like that. I mean, I I think I do have. Uh, do I have the perk for thorns? I actually don't remember. I do actually. I have plus oh. one thorns. Oh, weird. You should have got it. 
<laughs> also, why? <laughs> uh, I think I just oh. had an extra floating point, and I was like, well, just in case uh, I take thorns things. Countermeasures. Thorns plus one, and gain three thorns when damaged three times per round. Uh. And then Zex, at the start of your turn, for every eight dark I have, reduce the cost of cards in my hand by one until they're discarded. That's why Zex wants to have darkness on himself all the time. Hey, look at all this stuff. I mean, I guess that battle axe is better than your cleaver. No. Oh, well, because it's, it's... Yours is damage on hit, apply bleed. This is bleed charges plus two. Yeah, and it's apply five bleed on hit, and a lot of my attacks oh. don't naturally inflict bleeding. Okay. So the battle axe would only increase the bleeding on my volley and my rapid fire, and that's literally it. All right, fair Whereas enough. the cleaver is just like... I make them bleed with everything. I don't recommend shooting a cleaver out with a bow. That's probably not going to work as well as you'd hope. Uh, well, do uh, does Gustav want a poison flask? Nope. I want money. I like money. I hate being sad. I know you do. Heh. <laughs> <laughs> He's not actually doing this because he wants the money. He just <laughs> wants me to be sad. Oh, uh, but it's funny. How, how'd that go again? <laughs> It'll be sad and then remove it. <laughs> Was that worth 300? No. <laughs> but I did it. But it was still a thing I did. Uh, let's see. You're going next. This hand is a butt sandwich. <laughs> I got energy, and then I, I fixed my hurt. <laughs> Okay, now time to, to thorn up. And then heal. Uh, I guess we're still just going to work on you. Look, I apply bleed too. <laughs> yeah. I'm the bleed master. Well, let's not go too far. <laughs> uh, uh, I claim ownership over all bleed. There's a part of me that wants the plague shot, but I think I'll get the poison spray again. Now I'm applying poison and bloison. Oh, I love poison and bloison. Oh. Oh, yeah, yeah you shouldn't do that. <laughs> I, uh, I don't recommend. They made some decisions. No, no, no. You, they, you don't, don't do that. <laughs> that was a choice. Found a nice spell. <laughs> A third uh, cold snap? Yeah, why not? <laughs> I could take another vitalizing Saren. Uh, but I don't know if I want to. I already have two. This would be my third cold snap, but come on. Alright. Uh, I kind of like... Either standard bearer or falcon shot. Uh, I agree. Uh, Black Death is the worst one among all of these, easily. Yeah, Power uh, Slave is okay, but not for the build I'm doing with Gustav currently. So, yeah, standard bearer or falcon shot I think are both fine. 
Uh, do you have a preference? Um, I think I like Standard Bear slightly more just because giving everybody Inspire and Power, uh, yeah, particularly the Inspire. It, it's a very strong support card. So that way everyone can get their stuff more frequently. Uh, this looks like a rare equipment shop with a 30% discount. I need... The only way that I can upgrade any equipment on Bree is if I find the same equipment but corrupted. <laughs> so there's always the hope. <laughs> Everyone be faster. Because it was important. It was very important. Hold on, now I will make all of them slower. Uh, hey. Alright, I think we're winning the speed game. <laughs> Ah, oh, unforgiving nature. Yep. Uh, oh, now I have to make decisions. Decisions are hard. I could just Garden of Thorns and then Torment of Thorns to do significant like damage. Although, entrenching would be... well... Do we need the entrench though? Nah. Like it'd be kind of nice, but that's a lot of thorns. Look, I could do the damages too. I could do it. Look at me do it. Are you watching me do it? Yeah, corrupt burning shot. <laughs> this is the best place for that. <laughs> you know what? Just to spite the game. <laughs> Take this, fire monster! Look, I can use it on the... Actually, that's... It's not a bad amount of piercing damage, but... Uh... I like to think any other place that's just a regular arrow. <laughs> but you, you took it into a volcano, these things happen. You know what? Why would I let you get a turn? Yeah, I was going to say, the, with the bleed at the end of the turn, it's like, he's going to die, but eventually. Oh, yeah, you should... You, no, I don't recommend... No, you stop. No, no, no got, guy. All right, this guy, you, you can walk away. You could just just go home. You have a family. Oh, duck, God. <laughs> I tried to warn him. He wouldn't listen. Uh, I don't think I need another ice cold barrage. Uh, that's uh, nothing, nothing corrupted. Corrupt. Sad. I am disappointed. All right, lava boss. <laughs> Your sheep bought angrily at a rock. You know, she does that sometimes. <laughs> we haven't quite figured out why yet. The elf gets sharper. Look at how many region stacks Bree has now. Wow, yeah, that's not bad. Uh, let's see. Boom. I don't want that rock to continue rocking. Uh, I'm a battery, sort of. Uh, let's 
just, uh, actually, let's last hand first. Okay. Triple spike shield. And then we just do all of these. All right. Okay. How much get him can you get him? Oh, decay. Don't mind if I do. Although I don't think he tries <laughs> to heal. Uh, yeah, he's not doing heat assimilation this turn. But and I don't think he's going to get a second turn. Hopefully not. Uh, I have enough to do everything. You're so. welcome. Fruit, I appreciate. The weird Zek version of battery where I harm myself to do it. Alright. Oh, does that count as an attack? Oh, it sure does. Yep. And then at the end of his turn, he's just like, ow, the bloison! <laughs> no one suspects the bloison. <laughs> I was going to say, definitely Conquest before the Power Slave, but I don't know if you want a Rhythm before any of that. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out if I even want to play Melodic Rhythm. We don't need it. We really don't. So we're doing fine right now. Unless it does... But I... <laughs> if the Vitality wasn't acting weird... <laughs> I like to imagine it's doing it just to spite you. Yes. Ha ha! It, it, See, now it's... <laughs> <laughs> Game, I just want you to know that I'm upset with you. Uh, keep doing what you're doing, Game. You're doing great. Don't let your dreams be dreams. That's all the fanfare. So that did trigger... Uh, oh, I wasn't fully paying attention to whether or not that triggered the, the stuff, but just whatever. <laughs> uh, that's not it. So. There we go. Did all the things. Okay. Uh, now I can do some of the things. Uh... See, I guess I just blizzard cold snap blizzard. Uh, or, actually, now that that's done, maybe we uh, just do a little bit of that action. Um, yeah, this is fine. And he's dead. Or very close to it. And All right, wait Bree, for finish it. him. Wait for with it. The thorns. Nah. Ha ha. Victory. Uh, nope. And nah. Do I actually that? You looking at the music sheet? <laughs> Uh, the music sheet and the poison spray. I'm, like, debating both of those. That's poison, not blazon. Yeah. But because of my cleaver, it'll apply blazon <laughs> to the poison. <laughs> eh. And then the sweet loot. Oh, there's a cloak of speed. Um, do you want Zek to be super fast? Ah, uh, I could. There's also a life essence. That's that's yeah, not bad. Yeah, that that just makes me sad that I paid for one in town, but yeah, it's unuseful. Um, no, I get the black guard on Zek. That's the smart play. Yeah. <laughs> oh.
could get the bloodstone on Sylvie if I really wanted to, but she doesn't need it. Yeah, I was gonna say I don't think she needs it, but I I was also thinking something similar. It's like you could. Plus, I don't actually plan on keeping the cleaver. Like I, yeah. I really want like a longbow or something. But all right, to the blue portal to a new frontier. Uh, the now, Fey Bulg uh, Forest. Uh, the uh, most of the assets should be updated now, from what I hear. So we should actually see like uh, elves and drakelings and such. Ooh, very exciting. Uh, this area is also an active obelisk on the horizon. A uh, bunch of stuff. It's Elflands, but there's there's a bit of a cold problem in the capital city. Oh, and there is nothing going on on this scene. There is literally nothing. nothing. That is exciting. <laughs> this is like the most anti-new biome seed in existence. <laughs> But look, we get to see it. Ooh, look at the town. It's so fancy. Oh, yeah. That's actually nice. And you can see the, the, the coldness in the distance. Yeah. I would say... Um, I've never gone as far north to the Grove. So you want to try to go that way? Yeah, because we've only ever gone there when we were yeah. getting Bree. Now that we have yeah. her, I don't know what she does there. Well, let's find out. The wounded thief. Uh, help me now that they were distracted by the cold. I went to the elven forest and got some precious gems. When I was going to leave, I was attacked by one of those wild beasts and they almost killed me. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Sylvie's angry. Uh, stolen items are on a hidden path near the forest entrance. Okay. And then we spare his life. Oh, uh, hey, look. There's some stolen items. Yeah. Uh, exotic equipment shop. Yeah, could be good. It could be corrupt. Ah, oh, so we're in the forest, and look at all these cold boys. Oh, I'm the fastest. <laughs> it's weird. Uh. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Battery Zack. Gonna draw some, I think. Uh, oh, these are skills. They don't count as spells. This is a spell. Ha ha! Victory! Oh, that's enough chill for Gustav to go next. Uh, Gustav is going next. Can you heal me? <laughs> <laughs> Ow! <laughs> Freaking taking half your own health. Oh, good. Song of Quickness. That's kind of what I was hoping to draw. I'm being a good boy battery, except my version hurts a lot. I have 28 darkness on myself. But, uh -huh. that, but that means that when I next go, assuming I get another turn, all my cards are going to be cheap. Two, five, six, seven, six, three, so that's fine. Oh, he's doing intense math. Yeah, take that, you dang frozen oh. squirrels. I think I'm going to put the evasion on you for a change, <laughs> because, um, you do things to yourself. <laughs> I hurt myself today. Also, this backlash is actually... I almost made myself explode. Look, and hey, you almost made yourself explode. Zek's loving it, though. He Zek. is going to have, like, minus three to the cost of all his cards next turn. Ho, ho, ho. Hey, look, I can heal. Uh, I don't think we're going to entrench. I think instead, I'll just have 176 thorns. All right. <laughs> you have a lot of ammunition. Yep. 
Uh, that's a corrupt plague shot. That's kind of tempting. But, but a one cost a, multi Yeah, I was going to say, that's a one cost nice. multi shot, though. You can afford that rain of arrows. I'm just saying. I can. That's that's pretty sweet. Falcon shot camo, rain upon them, sweet sweet death. Oh, and maybe even purging yeah, or uprooting. Oh well, I, that, that's I don't the, think I uproot. That's not the the AOE uproot. Yeah. <laughs> the, all the sounds. <laughs> There's the AOE uproot. And yeah, it's just multi shot, multi shot. Multi -shot. Multi -shot. <laughs> Ooh. All right. All right, now guys, Did whatever you do, don't attack me. This is for your own good. Uh, uh, no. All right, all right. This squirrel, will listen. Don't don't attack me. Uh, uh, come on. Look the other way. Go home. Uh, all right. You, you look wise, wiser than your other friends. Just don't, don't, but. <laughs> <laughs> Just immediately hits you. I keep trying to warn them. They just don't listen. Oh, if that, if that amulet of thorns was corrupted. Oh, what a day it would have been. I already bought a crossbow for Sylvie, and I already bought a harp for Gustav, <laughs> so. This is just a whole lot of yeah. stuff we don't need. But imagine if any of those things were corrupted. Uh, fifty-fifty for the forage. But if we fail on the forage, what happens? I don't know. I think if we critically fail, we don't even get the items. I think that's true. What do you say? We are bound to fail. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll do it anyway. Oh, only just barely, though. Okay, uh, so we we still got uh, yeah. the the thing. Like I said, I think it was just a critical failure that would have uh, caused us to, to leave the item. Oh, there's a corrupt elven quiver. How do you feel about that? Also, I don't have a crescent moon uh, unlocked. It's not bad. Yeah, this is the only place you get the Crescent Moon. Uh, it, it has thorns, but it's every two turns. Yeah, it's technically worse than the Corrupt Yggdrasil Root. It's not even... Well, I mean, it's a ring slot, so it's a whole different thing, but... Oh, yeah. Oh, you'd still. have to take it instead of the amulet. That's yeah. just... I was going to say, if it, if it was an accessory slot, I would have taken instead of the Royal Coin on Zek just to have it, but... I worked really hard to get that ring. <laughs> I feel like the Elven Quiver is not... Like, most corrupt items are, like, crazy powerful compared to the regular counterpart. That's just slightly better. I mean, if you you want to talk about its base stats, it's twice as good. But then when you factor in other stuff, then... Yeah. So. And I mean, she's got a cost reduction item in that slot, which cost reduction is kind of big. If this if this quiver the corruption gave like plus one sharp charges, then I would probably oh, take it. Goodbye, but... Crescent Moon. I'll miss you. But I couldn't take it. Uh, Gustav, do you want a last requiem? <laughs> Not really. <laughs> <laughs> Just dramatic pause. No. <laughs> it's. Look, I've tried to use that song before, and it's like, it's cursed. It's not that good. I set them on ice fire. <laughs> Vicer? Yes. So we're doing Vicer and Bloison. <laughs> I'd, I'd prefer if you never said any of that ever again. <laughs> but I will. I know you will. And that's the sad part. Uh, I need I need my big brainstorm. 
I need to get rid of that dark pack. Like, I, I got it because it was nice and corrupt and stuff, but it's just not what I'm doing right now. That's not, like, where my life is at right now, man. <laughs> like, you know? <laughs> but wait! <laughs> the first one! I'm so confused <laughs> right now. <laughs> like, the first one didn't do it, but then the second one did. I don't understand. I, I think Vitality is just bugged right now. <laughs> I want to heal Zek, but he kind of wants... To, oh, well, it's not enough dark to trigger his thing yeah. anyway, right? Yeah, yeah, he needs uh, eight or more. <laughs> I like to think that they added this in just to sow confusion, and it's working. <laughs> it really is. I don't understand what's happening. Bop. Ugh. Ugh. We're, in, we're in the ice biome now. Burning shots, you know, it's something. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I'll take it, but I don't like it. And then explosive shot. It's like, well, now we're just yeah. going to give you all the fire shots. Look, fire beats ice. I've played Pokemon. Okay. I'll take a bubbly. Just all of the cards right now. Yeah. Don't, don't do it. He survived. Yeah, that's because I didn't get my thorns doubler. Also, I, I want to find more of those. Also, I do love that the thorns don't decay on hit, so they're just... Oh yeah. So, good luck with that. You, you you just have to deal with it now. Although I will have to be careful for the boss of this land. <laughs> for reasons. Yeah. <laughs> or I don't for maximum dramatic effect. <laughs> Very selective. <laughs> yeah, I I left you that one. Uh, let's see. Just got the blizzard in there. I'm not even going to do extra damage to myself because it's unnecessary. <laughs> well, that's kind of nice. Yeah, uh, that, that's uh, the perfect time to draw it, too. Yeah, so I think I'm going to do that. Which also speeds everyone up because of the wing one, so I don't need this. Off. I think i just get rid of this now. Yeah, probably. Uh... I think as soon as you pass turns, my my quills just annihilate this guy. Oh, not quite. Almost. Oh, I wish that happened in. A, I wish the pet happened first. Uh, also, oh no. All right, sir. Please, I beg of you. All right, good. <laughs> good, you died of burning as opposed to dying on my thorns. Yeah, the Fixer got him first. <laughs> it wasn't the Bloison, that's for sure. Yep. <laughs> we need to be stopped. <laughs> All right, so this is normally where you get Bree. 
Uh, oh, she's ready to begin a lesson. Let me explain what forests are like. I, what? <laughs> yeah. Why are we taking a lesson on... Yeah. This is a theory about how trees are formed in the forest, and after a while, the lesson is more practical, and she teaches you how to find magic shards inside the grove. Here are some magic shards inside the grove. Uh, okay. You're welcome. Sure. Uh, still a coin flip. Hey, okay. successful coin flip. I'll take it. Into the broken wall. Ah. Oh. Exotic shop. Yeah. Show me corrupted gear. <sighs> oh, we got elves and an angry frozen dragon man. Also, you notice the closer we get to the center of uh, the town, the more cold we get at the start of every round. Yep. It's it's a little a little frosty in here. But it's okay. I can make most of them frosty. With one notable oh. exception. Also, I kind of like the uh, how the Draconoid looks. Yeah, he's not bad. Um, I'm gonna set up a good Thorn's turn, I think. Let's see. So, yeah, I think I'm going to make Zek. A little more battery for Act 4, but only a little bit. Hmm. I could heal Zek at the cost of getting rid of all that dark. I mean, the fight's not going to last long enough, so healing him is fine. It's like, yes, that would have given him minus two costs on his entire hand next turn, but I don't think it's going to matter much. Uh, oh, well, why, hello there. All right, Sylvie, finish them all off forever. Uh, let's see. Another volley. Another volley. Another volley. Do I want that, though? That's a lot of energy. I mean, you could volley volley multi-shot if you take it. Yeah, that's probably not bad. And then I think I just don't play the other ammunitions. Yeah, and then you can uproot something, although they are yeah. kind of vulnerable. But it's five poison! Purge all their thorns! Haha! <laughs> 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 Oh, he's fast. Oh, I don't rec I don't recommend you doing that. No, don't do it. Don't you do it? Oh, you really should. Oh no. Oh, nope. you've mistakes were made. All right, now I actually have some healing to do. Hey, look, healing serenade. Uh... Oh, with your fanfare, can you conquest first? Is that how that works? Yeah. And now everybody's fine. You know what? <laughs> oh, man. I'm so sharp. Technically, that will affect your, your porcupine yeah. attack. <laughs> oh, <laughs> <I got> <laughs> <evaded>. <laughs> oh, 
Uh, well, I like tried. I, I appreciate it. Uh, there we go. Just, just one or two thorns. Ready to go. Uh, let's see. You're going next. Oh, hold on. <laughs> I got more. That is three cold snaps. Well, shall we have some fun then? You're gonna like double blizzard and then throw a free frost nova? <laughs> I think I might as well. This is the spells that never end. They ended. <laughs> you know, I didn't. I didn't need you to come out with that. <laughs> I, I should have seen it coming, but. Ah, <laughs> oh, can't That's... can't afford it. Sad. Oh. Well, that works. <laughs> That'll do. A deep darkness on Zex is good if you're going the dark side, but I went more for the frost side, so... Something, something dark side. <laughs> Uh, all right, so oh, there, there could have been a corrupt porcupine. <laughs> ah. There could have, but there wasn't. Ah. <laughs> but there could have been. Uh, a lot of good stuff here, but I just my my hopes were were just dashed. There's a small part of me that is debating taking the porcupine on Sylvie because technically that synergizes with her piercing sharp and like you're giving everyone yeah. thorns not as much as you're giving yourself but enough that it would work I mean you can you can join in the the porcupine parade you know what let's let's, let's have fun <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> 